Hello everyone and welcome to the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. Yeah, I haven't done the daily- Ooh, this is just an Isaac run today. There's a new run in a few hours. I haven't done the daily in a while. Um, I've been a bit sick this- Who's this man? I saw this! I saw this on the, um... On the subreddit. Today. Oh, it's got the cartridge and the game kit. That's cool. And we got the magic crown thing. As well as a special item that's kind of cool this man is the president of or the CEO of Nintendo I think it's weird <laughs> who is this man <laughs> and especially if I hadn't been on the subreddit today it would have been a very strange um, like thing to start with the daily anyway um, there's been a kind of an update to Isaac today as well um, what happened was, ooh, Todd photo. What happens is, uh, oh, he's sad. <laughs> uh, there's been an update to the sacrifice rooms and how they work, which is kind of interesting. Ooh. Okay, so we don't get any um, bombs for this floor, so we can't actually check out what's in that box or our secret rooms, but that's okay. We're gonna head down to the next floor. Um, and this daily is to the cathedral, so we should be all right. We're gonna check out the curse room straight away, of course, because we might as well. We are rewarded with an extra spirit heart. I'm down with that. And uh, we found our item room straight away. So let's take a peek inside after we take care of these dudes. Skitty on mushroom is pretty good this early. Um, we've got pretty good rate of fire now, thanks to Torn Photo and Skinny on Mushroom. And, uh, as long as we don't get hit on a room, our damage should be fine, thanks to the, uh, the Crown of Light. I think it's called Crown of Light effect. All in all, not a super difficult daily so far. Also, I wonder how messed up we can make this guy. <laughs> Um, seeing as how he is the CEO of Nintendo, or was the CEO of Nintendo? I'm not sure. It's, um, I was just browsing the subreddit a bit to check on what the new update did. I mean, because, oh, did I take damage there? No. But that was weird. I didn't know that would happen, that you could still fall in the hole. Well, if you were, um... Invincible. So we got a speed upgrade. We also got to deal with the devil. It's Krampus. Oh, we really don't want to take damage. I mean, at the best of times, but because we we did take a damage uh, down sort of item, and we're relying on our crown. Okay, there we go. That's 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 our damage gone. <laughs> now this fight is gonna take like a million years. Oh. We're all right. We're all right. We're all right. Okay, we got a lump of coal and a lucky bomb to help us get that black heart. All right, and we did check out the item room already, but we might as well explore the whole floor. Okay, so he can still get beaten <laughs> with the wooden spoon. That's kind of funny. And they did, of course. I'm sure Nicholas had to get um like approval for all of this, you know, can't just use someone's likeness. So I'm, I'm sure the, it's kind of cool how the guys at Nintendo are down with it. I know there was a big um, hubbub about trying to get Isaac onto the new systems and stuff. I mean, I own a 2DS, I don't have a 3DS, but Isaac is one of the games that I would like definitely be interested in getting a 3DS for. There's a couple of other things on it that are kind of cool. I guess, um, but the fact that you can't get Isaac on the 2DS is why I would probably uh, buy a 3DS. I only got the 2DS because I was in Australia at the time, and um, I think it was a special package deal with um, Pokemon, uh, one of the new ones, uh, it wasn't X and Y, was it? I think it was X, oh it was Y, yeah, it's Pokemon Y. 
and then of course I bought Omega Ruby as well. Have a look and see what the new, if there's anything new and interesting coming out from Pokemon. I, I mean, you know, I'm a big Pokemon fan. Have we watched the anim the anime? It's just like one of my Japanese animes when I was a kid. Um, you know, played a uh, blue version. That was the one I got. Traded with the. All my friends. Primus. Ooh, dead cat. Right, well, if we've got dead cat here, we might as well pop this temperance down. Use it to milk a bit of money out of here. Ah, we activated the cartridge. Because we did that. That's cool. And we'll pop the game kid. Even if we don't get, um... The item out of this, it's fine. We at least managed to get some money. And if I have bombs, maybe I check the. Um, uh. So, I'm not too sure how Crown of Light actually works. Okay, no, we don't want to take more damage here. That would be silly. I'm not too sure how Crown of Light works. Oh, controller disconnected. No, you don't like my controller here? Oh dear. That's uh Okay, let's try it. Plugging it in and out again. That's very strange. Oh, it does not seem to want to pick up my controller. That's a pain in the butt. It's also a brand new controller. But we'll just have to switch to using the old mouse and keyboard then. Until I can fix this. Because I am very worried about having to restart the run. And then losing all the progress. Because Isaac does that. Mm, blue candle. I think is better than the game kid. In terms of damage output. So we'll switch on over to that, because I was a little bit worried about our damage. Without Crown of Light, we need something to um, fall back on Ooh. in times of trouble, for example, like right now. Okay, uh, Deep Pockets is good, we'll pick that up, pick up Spirit Heart of course, and we'll check here for the second secret room, was indeed there. And, you know, we'll stick with the cartridge. I think we'll stick with the cartridge for now. And then we'll check out. No, nope, it's not there. We're out of bombs. So, off we go to the next fight. Here we go. Fight Dark One. So, is Crown of Light for the entire floor? Is that how it works? Oh. Well, we've taken silly damage anyway. Oh, no, we have to be at full health. That's how it works. Okay. And because I took that um, half red heart of damage in the on the temperance machine, the blood bank, that um, we aren't getting our diamonds anymore. That's okay. We can get back here that way. And the PJs just gave us a lot of um, spirit hearts, which means that I am perfectly fine with taking the mark. And down we go. Hmm. So the mark, the mark actually just kind of um. Did you see that bony train up there? They were just pushing each other. That was kind of funny. Um, the mark kind of cancels out the odd mushroom that we did. We're kind of, I think, back to base damage maybe. Oh, Athame. That's not bad. I have no idea how you're supposed to pronounce that, but I pronounce it Athame. Curse of the tower. Ah, uh, no, thank you. Also, I will try and avoid picking it up accidentally, because that would be silly. Wow, blue candle just burning through Pete. Wow. Now we got an Athame shot off at the end there. Horrible blue candle. Oh my God, he's so fast. 
Oh, so very fast. <laughs> but Chubb killed himself, herself, sorry, on the um, blue candles right in there. Let's go down here. And um, it's a pretty comfortable run. I've taken some pretty bad damage, you know. Not very happy about that, but not much you can do about it except move on, you know. You gotta finish the run. And um, we definitely have a, a run if you pick up a couple more damage upgrades. I'm. I have a feeling we can definitely finish this one. Um, and of course we'll have to search our um, curse rooms and secret rooms and red chests in particular for uh, guppy items. We've already got dead cat. One third of the way there. Huh, that health up is a bit of a pain in the butt because that means we're not going to get our crown of light bonus. Unless we manage to pick up some more red hearts pretty quickly. Um, I don't think there's... We are very fast, actually. I don't know if it's a good idea to get even faster. But why not? He's so fast! Okay, maybe we can pick up a, uh, a red heart in our shop here. That would be nice. Uh, bombs, okay. Oh, it's just a greed fight. But we have a. Uh, did Blue Candle destroy that thingy? Whoa. I didn't know Blue Candle could do that. that. Yeah, that's new. Well, I never noticed that before. How odd. Okay. Mm. I mean, there's our boss fight. Whoa. Kind of hoping for a red heart to pop up. I mean, we are playing on normal. There we go. We are playing on normal. Uh, you don't get to pick the difficulty uh, for the daily. I mean, fortunately or unfortunately, depending on your perspective and how you prefer to play the game. I don't particularly mind. Um, if I'm having a particularly shit day, I you know I'll play on normal. I don't mind. And yeah, blue candle pretty much seals the deal here. Take two. Th oh, do we want counterfeit penny? It is better. Oh man, Mr. CEO, you need to sleep some more, man. You need some more sleep. Let's um, let's check out that last room up there. We might be missing something very important. And if we miss a goddamn guppy item, I'm gonna be very angry at myself. Well, this might be our secret room. It is not. Excuse me, could you uh pop up please? There we go. And I guess our secret room would be here then? Yep. And rune bag, which actually could be very, very useful indeed for our. Um, now that I know Blue Candle does this, what if Red Candle does it too? That's really handy, especially for saving bombs and getting some more cash. Because these special keepers, they can drop like nickels and dimes. Look at that, he's got 10 cents from using the Blue Candle. I mean, Blue Candle's already good, but this makes it even better. Nerf, please, Edmund. <laughs> but not like how you did the stopwatch, please don't do not do it like that. Don't do it like that. I need the stopwatch, I'm a scrub. Oh, we missed. Okay. Oh, we took our time. Try to get a little bit of cash out of that. No harm, no foul, fuss, no muss. And other such platitudes. That's right, there was nothing in our shop. I forgot. And, you know, we will stick with counterfeit Fanny. Okay, thank debts. We do want to try for boss rush, of course. I mean, that's how we get points. But I'm not too hard out today. I mean, like I said, just recovering from a pretty... I mean, I'm not even fully, like, 100%. But I'm recovering from a pretty, like, bad weekend. 
That guy's caught a bug or something. Ooh, a Yara rune. Yara rune. Oh, very nice. Oh, very nice indeed. Ah, here's our item room. Excuse me, could you die, spider? Uh, the map. That's strange. I've forgotten though, you could get the map in the item room. It's a very Nintendo y uh, themed run so far. Where can I? Oh, that's right, we have deep pockets. Mm. I mean, we could buy a spirit heart. Nothing wrong with that. And yeah, we may want to just speed it up a little bit if we're trying for boss rush. I mean, we took our time on the last two floors. We've already seen the item room on this floor and the shop. And we're fighting a boss that is a bit tanky, so yeah. Well, blue candle is definitely gonna help us if we want to speed through some rooms, you know? Oh, almost got hit there from Gish. That's okay. We'll take our little Gish and we'll head on down. I definitely think we can do um boss rush. Oh I forgot he shoots out of his butt too. And we've got the map, so we know it's gonna be over this way. Um hmm. But that means our item room. Oh we'll clear this way anyway, because this must be the way. And if we miss out on our item room, then that's unfortunate. What do we get? Hermit, okay. Okay, so if worse comes to worse, we can always um, just jump out of our. Um... Oh, I'll take the Degas route now. Uh, red candle, huh? <laughs> well, maybe we'll stick with blue candle. I'm not gonna reroll my run. I'm not that crazy. I'm not a crazy man. Although it's probably gonna be an amazing like brimstone run or something hidden in there, isn't it? Because that's the way these things go. Ooh. Come on. Alright. Ah, and there's our shop. So, the, I think those rooms down there might just be a dead end. Or maybe there's a library down there. Who knows? I don't know. But we're definitely making, like, really good time for boss rush. So, we're only 15 minutes in. Uh... Did we miss out on it? Yeah, there's a keeper head here. It'd be really fun if we got, like, um, head of the keeper or something. I mean, I mean, it would be funny because it would be like, ooh, chaos card, huh? Um, I've forgotten how to... Is it control? Okay, it's control to switch. Um, well, I guess we stick with the chaos card and we do boss rush. Uh, ooh, although, yeah, if we're going up to the cathedral, we can, yeah, we can do hush. So, we'll try hush as well. Oh, excuse me. Also, we picked up, um, BFF, not the Degas rune, it's okay. They might be wanting us to, explosive diarrhea, no thank you. And they might be wanting us to hold on to the, um, Degas rune in case there's like an awful curse or something. But we're holding on to the Chaos card and the Yarrow Rune. Of course, the slack thing about the Yarrow Rune on the daily is that unless you're um, going to the... Oh my god, that was terrible damage. That was not so bad, actually. It was, it was pretty bad, but could have been worse. The slack thing about taking damage is that we lose our... Um, our goddamn diamonds. Um, so we'll take the Polaroid, we'll check out our deal with the devil. Mm, we'll take the goat head, because that gives us two more, um, deals with the devil. Do we want the ability to fly? Of course we want the ability to fly. Uh, the ladder and how did you, of course. <laughs> well, we'll p pick this up. We don't need the ladder. We can already fly, so. And flight is better than the ladder, so. But of course, those are two very Nintendo-y um, items. 
the latter, of course, uh, a staple from... I don't know if it's a staple in the Legend of Zelda anymore, but I do remember it was in the first one, or the second one, or Zelda 2. Zelda 1 or Zelda 2 had the ladder in it. And how to jump is, of course, uh, Mario Brothers uh, reference. Because of Jumpman, which is Mario's name originally. He was the Jumpman, because he could jump. Yeah, I'll just switch to the year. I was looking at the bottom right -hand corner of the screen while waiting for the next wave to spawn. I was like, it'll be really slack if I accidentally use my Chaos card here instead of on Hush. So, I'm going to um, switch to the Yara rune. It would also be kind of like slack if I use my Yara rune. What rune is this? Al Al Algiz. I always pronounce it Algiz before. Um, but the guy, the rune pill man, rune pill man, he um, pronounces it Algiz. So, I guess we go with Algiz. I mean, might as well go with a canonical name. Except for Megastan, of course. We always pronounce Megastan as uh, Megastan. Let's try and get some Athame action in there. I don't even know how to pronounce Athame, so. Oh, double pink cages. Come on, Nintendo. Nintendo 64. That's dark one. Is that dark one or the adversary? It's the adversary. Okay, so we, we want to be careful when fighting the adversary. We might actually just want to pop the Algiz rune because we don't want to get hit by some fucking bullshit um, brimstone beams. We don't want that. And the Algiz rune will give us the ability to just wail away on these guys. Very tanky. It's a very tanky wave. Wow. This kind of does highlight our lack of damage, really. Is that another rune that dropped? What's up with that? What happened there? What's going on? Ed. Hagla's rune. Eh, might as well pop it. Of course, that's a bad idea because it just um, got rid of all of our cover. I just realized now that's a bad thing to do. You don't want to get rid of your cover. You have to keep your cover. This cover is what allows you to dodge enemy shots. Ha ha. Of course, now that we've had a um, pretty fun daily like this, it does mean that tomorrow, or in a few hours, our daily is going to be like a goddamn lost daily or something. Just because that's how it goes. Okay. Maybe want to take care of this angel first. Alright. Yeah. I think it's kind of good that we um, decided to do boss rush early. Or early ish. Because that allows us a little bit more leeway in terms of time. Ah. Yeah, really having to concentrate now. Maybe if we can get Gish on the spikes, we can hurt him a bit more. Alright, we're doing alright. We're doing alright. I don't know how many waves we fought or how many more are left. I, l I lose count on um, boss rush now. It's another rune, Bikano rune, might as well pop it. Why are we getting so many runes? This is rune, oh it's rune bag paying out, of course. I mean, you probably shouldn't question it. I mean, there's all these runes dropping, that's, that's terrible. Runes are really good. It's because of um, an Awas rune, huh? Well, we could skip. Ah, we could skip. Ooh, we could skip to the chest. I think. I think. So now it becomes: Do we? Um, I mean, we're not going to drop the chaos card, of course. I need the chaos card. 
Otherwise, I won't be able to beat um, Hush with this build, I think. It would be very difficult to. Let's get in there with the FM, FMMA. FMMA. There's even more click clack with um with the keyboard than there is with the uh, goddamn controller. Oh my god! Come on, Albert, get your shit together. All right. So if I was smart, I would um ah, start planning ahead now. I kind of want to. If we get any more spirit hearts, try not to pick them up, and we'll yarrow them because we can. Because we're not taking the Yara rune with us, we're taking the Awaz rune for the chance of getting an extra floor in. Where is the wall? There he is. I don't know why I chased him. It should have gone the other way. Come on. Oh my god, this is taking forever. We're gonna have to rush if we want hush. Oh my god. You just don't have the damage, man. Excuse me? Can you... Can you just stand still, please? Oh my god, war! Piece of shit. He's my run! You bastard! Might act have to, like, actually use the AWAS rune to skip a floor. So that we can have a go at Hush. I mean, we need a hush if we want to score well on the daily. That's that's it. Okay, come on. Completely missed with that blue candle, but it sounds like we hit someone in the back there. Oh my god! Oh my god! Please, just just die, please. We got five. Yeah, we're not gonna make it in five minutes. We're gonna have to Awas rune our way down there. Um, we could always hope for maybe another lucky Awas rune, you know? It's not impossible. Come on. Come on, you son of a bitch. Come here. Oh yeah, I'm getting sloppy. Okay, it's two. <gasps> we have two Awas runes. The dream is real. We only have to do one floor. Also, is it just me? Is this boss rush just like getting more and more like intense as it goes on? Oh my god. Oh, we killed him! Shit. Come on. Oh. Hmm. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, compass, huh? Ooh, compass. Okay, okay. So we want the Awas rune. We leave the Yara rune. Okay, we can do this. We can do this. So the Awas on this floor, we're gonna miss a deal with the devil. Uh, can we make it? Maybe the map and compass, huh? Uh, no, we have four minutes. We're gonna have to skip a floor. Okay. And then. It is not very far to our boss room. If we are quick about it, maybe we bomb our way through a few rooms. If we can. Are we done here? No, come on. I should have picked up that bomb. We got this though, we got this, we got this. Don't worry about it. We got this dog. Yeah. Answers rune. We don't really need it. Can we bomb our way through here? We can indeed. Goodbye. Ah, why are you fighting? Stop fighting! Okay, we have to fight the next room. Also, we'll need keys for the hush fight. <laughs> okay. This might be our uh, second secret room. It is! Come on. Pills, huh? Explosive area. Full health. Full health. Nope. 
It's too late. I gotta go. Okay. We got nine lives as well. So be prepared for maybe to lose a couple of them. For maybe to lose a couple of them. Yes, I can. I speak the English language. Oh. We can do this. Ooh. No, you son of a bitch! Okay, okay, okay. So, do that. Like that. We need to get into there and here. And then it's when we drop the blue candle in the middle there. And we only have one hit. And I may... I know there's a health up pill in our rotation as well. I mean, the last thing we want is to, like, actively die. So... Kill mom counts as a kill. These items suck. Testicles. We're not even gonna pick them up. And we made it to the hush fight. Whew. Okay. Check our shop. There is a key in here, which is what I want to see. That's what I like to see. You got a one makes you larger pill. Higher fin, which is useful. And Trinity Shield, huh? Yeah, Trinity Shield will help with the Isaac fight. And I think we go for the damage, actually. Instead of Nordleaf. Fun guy. We've got the fun guy formation. Formation! Transformation. Okay, so. We have to fight this stage of Hush. I've heard you can get them both with one um, Chaos card. But uh, <laughs> we're not going to risk it. Yeah, Biscuit. Okay. No worries. Almost got him. Okay, there we go. Last time for the big guy himself. Or herself, you know. Chaos card, boom. You've activated my Chaos card. And we got a Yarrow Rune for our troubles. Was there a chance of a Red Heart? No. That's okay. Because we're going to need a Red Heart if we want our Diamond back. But that's okay. Uh, we can also hope for a Lucky Chaos. Oh, not Chaos. Card, although Chaos Card would be nice. We can hope for a Awaz rune. Might let us get to um, the chest. Might not. Never know. And um, now's a good time to make up for all those lost points that we got um, for skipping room one. But it did look like skipping room one was the only way we were going to make hush. So, oh my god. I'm sure either way probably adds up to similar points. We've also almost lost all of our goddamn spirit hearts. I am such an idiot. Ah, come on. Ah, okay, there we go. We'll get our diamonds back now. We're on the next room, I guess. I've done the Isaac fight quite a few times now, so I, I'm pretty certain I can do it with this build. I mean, Trinity Shield is really good for the Isaac fight. Um, Blue Candle will help immensely. And, um, luck down. Oh, that's not good. And being able to use our, oh my god, Crown of Light is going to be handy too. So, I might want to try and hold on to some of that health, huh? Jeez Louise. I'm gonna lose a lot of points today on um, ye old taking damage. Okay, that's a nice sound. A nice ring a ding ding when you picked up all those um, coins and stuff. Oh, that guy looked pretty lonely in here in this room. What's this? Yara rune. You can't Yara Yara rune. This is true. 
Can Yera a spirit hot? Probably not the best use of the Yera rune, to be honest, but what the hell. Okay, so as long as we stand still in front of these greeds, we shouldn't be hit by their shots, because we have the shield, right? That's what the shield does. Blocks shots. Kind of the job of a shield. That's what the shield does. It blocks the shots. It also casts the spells that makes the peoples fall down. Uh, yeah, there was also a whole bunch of news about Final Fantasy VII today. Like the remake. Um... I mean, there was like some actual goddamn footage, which looked. My nostalgia meter was just like off the goddamn charts. You know? I mean, they had Jesse and Biggs and Wedge and Barrett wearing sunglasses now for some reason. I don't know why. And then everyone was like, oh, he looks like Wesley Snipes on r slash gaming because, of course, everyone is a huge racist. And because he's a black man wearing um, sunglasses, he, of course, looks like Wesley Snipes. Uh, Petro Room. Answers room. Hmm. Hmm. All of these are interesting. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know what I was going for there. But there was also some news about like how it's gonna be like a multi-part game. Like it's gonna come out in more than one installment. Which... Uh, it's a little bit warning bells, Squeenix. I mean, uh, it's keys, right? So I might as well take flat penny. Yeah, I wasn't too happy about that. I mean, it looks gorgeous, of course. It's like next gen graphics for Final Fantasy VII. But, like, I don't want to have to buy like seven installments. I'd like to buy it once. You know? Of course, I mean, there was the discussion on the subreddit, and um, some people suggested that maybe it was... Oh, God damn, of course we need a bomb. Of course we're short of a bomb. That's okay, we can get a bomb. There's, okay, there's no bomb in here, but there might be bombs later on the floor. We'll come back for that. Uh, there was a suggestion on the subreddit that... Um, I don't know if you know, but there were also a whole bunch of other... Final Fantasy VII, um, like, things that were part of the series, you know? There was, like, the movie, there was, uh, Dirge of Cerberus, I don't know why I pronounce it like that. Dirge of Cerberus. Yeah. Um, there was... Crisis Core. Um, this is a whole bunch of Final Fantasy VII-ish stuff, you know? Because it was such a big game. And fans wanted more. And so Square Enix was like, hey, we can make money off of these people. Let's give them some more stuff so we can get their money. So that's what happened. Um, we don't have any bombs, huh? It's kind of shit. Oh my god. No! I need red hearts. Um, what's this? Oh, gears. Okay, that means we win. We win the fight, pretty much. Um, so we want to pop down this... Where is the Wheel of Fortune? Okay, pop down the Wheel of Fortune. Try and get a bomb. We want a bomb. Please. There we go. So yeah, it might be that they're doing like a weird... You know, they're going to put all of the games together in like one continuity sort of thing. Or they could just be complete assholes and um, split up Final Fantasy 7 into like the three discs that it originally came on or um, split it into like different chapters which really I don't know how that would work would you buy like a season pass for that I don't know it's also way too early to like speculate about this kind of shit they haven't even really confirmed that it's coming to PC they said that it's the official thing on the trailer for the announcement was that it was coming to uh, PlayStation 4 first. So, of course, everybody assumes that, you know, it'll come to PC eventually or something. I, I don't know. Um, if there is no, like, official word on, like, whether it's coming to PC or not, which is the platform I currently own and play all my games on, 
then I'll have to buy a PlayStation 4. And, you know, and I think Square Enix knows that. They know that there are people like me who love that game way too much. You know, play it every couple of years or every year through to the end. And, um, yeah, we will pay through the nose for the remake. And I just, it's kind of sad. It almost feels like being taken advantage of. Especially when you hear like disappointing stuff, like they're gonna split it up into different parts or whatever. But we'll see how it goes. You know, I want to play it, so I will play it. And it's also kind of liberating to be able to say that, you know, and also kind of nice that to have something to aim for <laughs> in life. Right. Enough romanticizing and fantasizing. Final fantasizing. Uh, where's that Perthra rune? Yeah. Got the boomerang. Um, yeah. If we were doing more damage, I would totally just um, go boomerang and um, fight Isaac to make it like a total Legend of Zelda reference. We can actually just get really close up in here because of Algiers. We've won. Don't worry about it. And we explored the entirety of. Um, of the cathedral because we could. Um, I think we did okay today. I took a lot of dumb damage, that's for sure. And uh, Algus rune has run out, but we've done enough damage to Isaac that he should be dead soon. He will be dead. I took some damage from the beams of light. It's very silly. That's like the easiest thing to dodge in this fight. But yeah, I can see this being a semi-difficult run. Especially from the lack of damage standpoint. 2196. Well, we didn't do as well as I thought we did. But that's probably because we skipped um, an entire floor. But that's okay. We managed to get this done. I, um, I, I like this run. I like the, the little Nintendo nod there. That's very nice. And did Bentley do this run today? I think she did. She's on the friends list. And yeah. Why did she die? She died on level 6. Okay. Well, you know. That's not good, Benny. Pull up your socks. <laughs> anyway, thank you very much for watching. It's been another Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Daily Challenge. Apologies for missing a few in the last couple of days. But um, we'll try to get back to a regular schedule of Afterbirthy goodness. Goodbye.